Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is the Brown Barbie or Deasia. But we go by the Brown Barbie over here and you guys are officially a part of the gang. So hit that subscribe button if you want to see how this came out. Keep watching if you want to see how I achieved this look. And of course, comment down below throughout the video your favorite parts, what's funny, any questions. And of course, add me on Instagram so y'all could see how some of these looks turn out in pictures like this was really slayed y'all like baby stiff where 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 like i'm sorry are you talking to me sir i i, I can't hear you over my hair period so let's just get right into this video before i keep clowning around So as you guys seen in the beginning, to get that bomb look we got, I have my wig right here and a bit of information about it. It is 1814, 1816, 14 from the Beauty Factory. I spent about 60 bucks on this hair and it's actually very good quality. And then this closure I already had had from before and I cut it off of another wig just to, you know, save some coins because... Y'all already know what I'm saying. So I got the scarf just to really lay down my natural hair because I really want this install to be really pretty. I don't want any of my hair out. And when I be doing it, my hair be out. And I don't like that. So yeah, I just need to get some chapstick. So I did make that unit myself. I made it when I came to school with a little styrofoam wig head. And the wig cap is so crazy. It's just it was a crazy experience. But let's just get right into it. So I already prepped my hair. I'm gonna actually move the wig cap up a bit more than I normally do because it gets pulled back. And I did install the combs and an elastic band. So we're putting the combs in right now. I didn't check to see if it was straight or even, which it actually is not. All right. So we want to do a middle part today. So that is actually essential to have that centered or centered enough. All right, so I'm just gonna get started in the detangling process. Y'all are just gonna see me detangle it. I'm not gonna talk that much. We're just gonna wet it. I wanna get a bone straight middle part today. So y'all just gonna see me detangling, ain't nothing, nothing else. all right so we are finished detangling it i still have to put in the middle part as well as glue it down i just really wanted to get the detangling part out just so we didn't have to worry about that so now i'm just gonna get my hair protectant slash hair sign shine i just put it in a different container i got this from the dollar tree y'all that thing has never not leaked out yet knocked on wood that's a good good cop from the dollar tree little travel size container so just as you guys see this is the unit it is a closure piece just one more time for your reiteration so yeah we're just gonna comb this through comb this through i'm gonna put this middle part right now a hat you may think when you're dealing with a wig or anything like that, getting a rat's tail comb will be perfect to get your part. Actually, that is false. I recommend you getting a comb, like a medium tooth comb like this, or if you want to get a curved part 
you are doing the side part and you want it curved, use a wide and then you go in and clean it up with the rat sales comb. So you might not get that look you want right off the beginning if you use a rat's tails comb. So I recommend you use this. And it's gonna give me a hard time because it's in a side part, so we gotta be patient. So that is pretty much done. I'm just gonna put some foam just to re-put down that part because child, that was giving me a hard time. Um, it's a weird color right now because I have a different type of white cap on and I didn't add my foundation color. So I'm just gonna definitely go in and really fix that part heavy. But I haven't done a middle part in a while, you guys, and I'm already kind of liking it surprisingly like it's been a while and I haven't cut any layers on this unit or anything like that. I've been going back and forth because I don't want to cut my baby. I want my inches, man. I done spent my bread to get these inches. I want my inches to stay forever. So, yeah, I'm feeling it right now. Like, even though it's about to fall off my head, but I'm going to pull this up. So, we're going to glue it always glue above your hairline never glue right on it that's why a lot of people prefer to do the bald cap method because naturally your hairline is going to come up a little more when you do the bald cap method but never ever glue right here you don't want your hair to start right there because naturally if you have a frontal it'll already be plucked and your hair your, your hairline will naturally kind of start a little farther back if that makes sense next time i have a frontal i definitely will go into depth about that and the steps and blah 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 so i'm gonna go in with my ghost bond xl hopefully it's focusing hopefully you guys can see um do i recommend this over anything else i i definitely want to try the erica j i actually have the hairspray at home it literally came literally literally right when i touched down and i got at the airport so i had to text my friend like can you please um like go pick up my package because nobody is not stealing that did so she went and picked it up for me from my house and um put it on my porch for me but yeah so i have the hairspray by erica j that i'm super excited to try out i you know i'm not even gonna go into depth but anybody who pays attention to my hair videos knows that i say she taught it all to me. Like I, she taught everything to me. She taught everything to me. Without her, I would not know how to install hair and that's just the snapple fact. So while that's drying, we got a little bit in our hair, but the ghost bond, if you have a remover like I have, this is a really good lace remover. It smells citrusy. With a lot of lace removers, you get that strong, nasty smell and it's just, ugh. But this has a citrus smell, it makes the glue peel off super easy, and especially with the ghost bond, it comes off like that off the um, lace as well as your hairline because this isn't a waterproof. It says sweat proof and waterproof, but it's not one of those like hardcore ones, if that makes sense. So I recommend that. But um, I'm not sure what's going with that, but I'm pretty sure I made my point. I'm gonna really try to bring you guys a lot of hair content. So hopefully I could start getting some hair sponsorships. And I would really, really love that because baby girl, it's, it's, it's tough times over here. It's a tough time. So now we're just gonna lay the lace. I kind of cut the lace at a very, like when I say a weird angle, I cut this so weird. I don't even know why I cut it like that. Let me make sure it's not too far up, okay. Baby, what, what lace? Like, I don't be knowing, I truly don't know how I be finessing lace the way I do, but like, I, I be doing it. Oh, the lace folded in, okay, we got it. This time I kind of gave myself a widow's peak on accident, but it actually makes it look way more natural. 
like way more natural. So next time you're installing your wig, give yourself a little point at the front and watch how your install change. So as I said before, I'm just gonna tie this down. Just move it I've been wearing my hair all week, so I was like, okay, let me get my this wig a break because this child it was not my friend. It was not being my friend. But I'm happy it is my friend while we're making this video because we need this content. So Taylor, she's one of my roommates. She was like, I smell you straightening your hair. I miss straightening my hair, and I'm like thanks i'm sorry that the smell you know brought you know brought some nostalgia to you but i'm sorry you had to smell it <laughs> like but so i'm just gonna straighten my hair and y'all are just gonna see it get straightened I'm, uh, who are you? I'm, I mean, who are you? What? What? Baby. I only accept, I only accept, I only accept geese off Cash App, Venmo, or in Chanel. Please, baby. I have never straightened hair this good a day in my life. Like, I've done it, like, once or twice, but not like this, like, it's serving like and we got the link too baby like and I, i'm not even that's the gag is i'm not even done with my hair like we didn't even add like the phone we didn't do nothing yes this just got bodied like this is baby like what and we just got to put this like a little bit just to wipe that excess off. But just like, wow. I did that, y'all. Like, and I'm not even a middle part fan, but this is serving right now. Like, this is serving. So as you guys know, before I take my Pro Fusion Highlight and Contour Kit, very much ghetto. My grandma gave this to me as a gift, I believe. And this has been coming in clutch. So I usually actually take the medium chisel, but lately I've been having to do the beige light just because I don't know if the lace started developing a different color, but that wasn't working for you, good sis. So we gotta do this beige light. 
some spots are just too too light i'm gonna go in with my foam i just want a little bit not a lot just to reiterate these areas and then just get it up in this front curve i honestly could add baby hairs if i want so i'm just gonna go like this and what comes down is what will be baby hairs. If none come down, I will make some. <sighs> oh, we don't miss the piece, baby. You need to be straight. So for my baby hair combination, I'm honestly just gonna get this edge booster. You're not supposed to use edge control when you do your baby hairs, but th this edge booster is not even that amazing. So I'm just using it because it's not gonna even do what I, it's not gonna last as long as you would think, so. So now I'm just gonna get my big paddle brush. As y'all see, this is the track I cut. I'm gonna get my big paddle brush and just brush my hair. Just get all those frilly pieces away. Really do it for that concealer part. All right, so what are you guys' thoughts on this look? Do you think it was slayed? Do you think it came out right? Or do you think something was missing? Um, don't mind the part because it's whatever. But yeah, let me know your thoughts. I think this came out super cute. This was a super quick install. I'm not sure how this video, how long this video is, but I'm hoping this video's no longer than like 10-ish minutes because it really wasn't longer than 10 minutes overall besides me talking all right so thank you guys so much for tuning in please hit that subscribe button like if you want to see more content like this just so i know where y'all heads is at and we are at we are at 108 subscribers y'all i i know it might not seem like i'm thankful because like maybe my energy was i know my energy was a little dry in the last video as well as i'm not posting that much but trust and believe, I, I'm so happy that we have reached this. I have my own custom URL. So now you can just put in YouTube slash C slash the brown Barbie and y'all go right to my page. Uh, I'm just happy because honestly, I came such a long way. Just a little old girl who just wanted to do this. Like anybody can tell you since I was young, I love being the spotlight. I loved, I loved it. So it's like, this is really like my platform in my area to express and be the type of person I wanna be. Um, I know the road is not gonna be easy and I'm not expecting it to be, but I just truly thank you guys for your support constantly. It keeps me going, even though it might not seem like it, but I just wanna say thank you guys so much again. And I'm excited for all the content that I'm bringing you this year and all the manifestations. So please tune in to my manifestation video as well as add me on Clubhouse at The Brown Barbie with two E's I believe because I try to make most of my platforms match up with my Instagram or my YouTube, but y'all will find me. So um, yeah, so add me on Clubhouse because we do, I host, a, I host my own room called Manifestation Mondays and testimony Tuesdays I almost forgot so like I said in my last video if you need a clubhouse invite I have three left as of right now so please comment down below obviously first come first serve I only have three I really can't do that much with because I really only have three I'm, I'm just super happy so I'm just gonna close this out because I'll keep rumbling and rambling but I hope you guys enjoyed this video hope that it was some type of knowledge even though i didn't really do much talking it was more so just like watch me get ready type of thing but i truly appreciate all your guys support have an amazing day bye <laughs>